I remember that. Hi. Hi, hello. We are taking a look at what is the uh, the final trailer for the Super Mario Bros. movie. I haven't really outlined how like excited I was. I haven't, we haven't really done a lot of like reactions like to what's been going on here. As we roll into April, I'm getting excited for like the movie. So I think it's takes time for us to take a look at this final trailer. All right, we're gonna jump into this in three, two, one, and play. All right, just gonna monitor the uh, the audio. Hopefully it sounds good. I might lower just a just a just a tinge, like right there. Hello everyone, I'm Shigeru Miyamoto from Nintendo. Today, I'm excited for you all to see the third and final trailer for the Super Mario Brothers movie. Let's go. By the way, do you know what March 10th is? Mario Day. Wait. The date in English, it looks like this. Okay, do you see it? Ah, I get it. I get it. We got it. That's <laughs> why many fans call it the Day of Mario. Otherwise known as Mario Day. And so we just embraced it. This day would be perfect for releasing the final trailer, so that's why we chose it this time around. Due to time differences, it's the day before in some regions, but I true, hope true. enjoy it all the same. On this special day, I'm joined once again by Chris Melodandri. Hello, Chris san. Thank you, Miyamoto san. After six years of work, Nintendo and Illumination have finally wrapped post production on the Super Mario Brothers movie. Nice. Now, nearly 600 people worked on this film. From our animators in France to the Nintendo team in Japan, Slough, folks. and our Illumination team here in the United States. And it pushed the technical and artistic capabilities of our studio to new heights. Anyone from anywhere at any age can find something to love in this film. Am I seeing so something right here on the side? This oh, sorry, you know, the most. that's After mine. This trailer, I've asked our directors Aaron Horvath and Michael Jelinek to share a few insights, so please stick around for that. But first, let's say hello to our cast. Hey, hey Nintendo Direct! Oh my god, Mario. here we go. It's exciting to be here with you all to celebrate the Mario Brothers. And don't forget, Luigi is a Mario Brother too, so don't be afraid to celebrate the Green Man if you choose to. I really true, appreciate true. You saying that. Well, yeah, yeah. Green Brothers are for. And if you choose to celebrate Donkey Kong, that is also acceptable. Or Toad. Yeah, well, no, okay. <laughs> no, 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 Toad. Afraid. It's okay to celebrate Luigi Just kidding. Mario Day, but to celebrate Mario everybody. Day or Toad. I'm Mario Day, you know, Luigi's Mario brother, so. I don't know, Charlie, it feels a little bit unfair. Oh, come on, can Luigi get some shine just once? You know, back me up here, Chris, right? I'm gonna stay out of this. Uh, let's go to <laughs> Anya and Jack. Hello again, Nintendo Direct. Anya and I are here together to prove that despite our on-screen differences, we're actually totally cool in real life. Yeah, absolutely. We're so cool, in fact, that Anya has agreed to officially proclaim this day as Bowser Day 2023. That's oh, that's very nice of her. Canceled. You're welcome. Um, oh. I, I never agreed to that. Can we cut that part where she disagrees? Uh, please don't cut that part. Come on, Bowser Day! It's awesome. I think Mario Day encompasses everything in the Mario franchise. Relax. Let's agree that Mario Day is for everyone. This is the first time Charlie-san and Keegan-san have appeared in a Nintendo Direct, and their performances of Luigi and Toad are perfect. I'm looking forward to hearing them. Okay, let's press the start button on the final trailer. Ah! Uh, now I'm all of a sudden, like, really, really, really excited. Where am I? <laughs> Ooh, fresh meat for the grinder. Pay him no heed. He is cute, but he is. There's gotta be a way out of here. There's no escape. The only hope is the sweet relief of death. Whoa! Oh, you've got to be kidding me! <laughs> Not the Luma. <laughs> Oh, Fire DK is crazy. Oh, he also has the ground pound. I just realized that. Here we go. 
Also looking forward to the Mario Kart segment. And the sound effects. Oh my god. Wait, how long is this movie if it's going to incorporate this type of sequence? I know, I know tickets are out, I should probably go get those. What did you all think? <laughs> that was actually, that was a lot of fun. Also here from Aaron and Michael. I don't think it, I don't think it revealed too much, per se. Hello Nintendo Direct. I'm Aaron Horvath. And I'm Michael Jelinek, and we're honored to be the directors of the Super Mario Brothers movie. We wanted to take a second to talk about that Rainbow Road footage you just saw. Oh? In Mario Kart, Rainbow Road isn't just beautiful to look at, it is also one of the least forgiving courses in the game. As it's true, with the true. Universe, we wanted to recreate that same sense of danger and epic scale on the big screen. Fair enough, yeah. We also yeah. brought in artists who specialize in vehicle design and work closely with the team at Nintendo to create some new carts that felt organic to the the Jungle Kingdom while still inspired by the iconic game designs. Our passionate artists outdid themselves in the execution. We improved our lighting and rendering I have something to say at the end. To elevate this movie beyond anything Illumination has ever done. We're excited for how this came out and can't wait for you to experience it in theaters April 5th. Back to you Miyamoto-san. Thank you Aaron-san and Michael-san. As Chris-san confirmed earlier, post-production is finally done and the movie is complete. It releases mm. next month, and currently, it's being localized for different countries. Some regions have already started selling advanced tickets. I hope you'll go to a movie theater with family and friends, and cheer for Mario's team. We're currently making plans too. I have one more thing to share. Huh? For Mario Day, we recreated the boots that Mario wears. Oh yeah, I heard about that. People already posted pictures of it. It's kind of crazy. So if you have a chance to stop by, please do take a look at them. It probably competes with uh, Sora's shoes as far as like the damage, the impact. That, that's it. So that was great. That was a fantastic uh, last bit trailer. It showed like a lot of extra stuff that like gets us really excited. I don't think any spoilers were really like detailed in this one as far as like how plots get moved forward or if there was any like crazy cameos to see. The only crazy thing was probably seeing Fire DK. And that was kind, I think that was it. And maybe just like that new sequence of like Luigi being caged up and how Bowser is like kidnapping everybody. Um, I think that's the only thing. But otherwise, that's great. Honestly, yeah. I think, uh, wait, actually, there's something I wanted to point out. So they had, they talked about like the different like designs for like these carts in the Mario Kart segment. And they wanted to talk about how they want to recreate like how dangerous like Rainbow Road is as just like as an idea, if anything for like a racing track with that i was thinking like compounded with like the mario kart 8 dlc which is still going like right now do you think that they're going to try to incorporate a lot of the designs here and put them into the dlc maybe not as like new courses obviously unless they want to make a new rainbow ray blah, 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 new rainbow road kind of like how they design here and make their own be put into the game I think that'd be kind of crazy. I'm not sure if anyone would want, like, any of their slots taken up, though, as far as, like, a requested course from a previous game. But if they just did that, I think that wouldn't, like... I think that would have been perfect, actually. And also, just new, like, uh, carts as well. We see that Mario has, like, his own, which is kind of... Um, I see a lot of, like, influence from, like, like the Advance. I also see the one from DS as well kind of being integrated into that one, but it's a lot more mechanical. It's much more designed as like a go-kart than, you know, the things that we see in Mario Kart, just generally speaking. So I think that would be super cool to see as like its own like cart that's just brought in to the DLC. But yeah, that's, that's just something I really wanted to bring up though, because I j we just played Mario Kart like last night with like the new recent DLC stuff, the one that includes Singapore. Um, yeah, no, I think that would have been great. Uh, but as far as kind of going back to the movie, I think uh, this is just the level of like care and design. I'm seeing that just from this trailer by itself. So I'm really, really looking forward to seeing how the movie ends up being. And I mean, hopefully it paves the way for like other franchises in Nintendo to get their own works because I think of and of any type of uh, studio. Granted, you know, PlayStation's got its own thing with Last of Us, like being on HBO, and that's definitely gaining a lot of traction there too 
but I also believe that as far as like the animation side of things, I think that just Nintendo as a whole has a lot to really work with. And I'm kind of hoping that it kind of leads to other things being shown up as well. Like, could you imagine like a whole like Kirby movie with Illumination or just like, you know, well, actually, yes, Illumination, actually. <laughs> I think that would work really well with Kirby, actually. But then I'm starting to think about like Metroid. I'm also thinking about Legend of Zelda. Like, how would you do that if they wanted to do that? But I guess it's also about like them being like keen on that idea, being open to that. I think for now. We're just going to have to settle with how well uh, the Mario Brothers movie uh, does. And if that makes a sequel in of itself. So we'll see. We will definitely see. But guys, that's going to just be it for me. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, if any exciting like game movie related stuff is here, that I'll, I'll definitely take a look at that. But um, if there's anything else, uh, feel free to let me know if there's anything you might want me to like take a look at. And we'll definitely consider it. But yeah. All right. Take it easy, everybody. Hope to see you guys in the next one. Hashtag bye, everybody.